It's time for every play's multiplayer Civ 6. Hey guys. The ancient era ends in eight turns. I am going to have a I think I'm gonna avoid a dark age. I'm not necessarily gonna have a golden age. It's kind of the worst place I could be in a certain manner of speaking. Oops. Dark age, dark age, dark, 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 dark. Okay. Oh no, I lost the very dude. Or I sent him off on an excursion. We should be protecting this guy. Alright. This seems to be a perfectly cromulent place to be. Um. Go here. Okay. Um. <coughs> Achen. Achen, Achen. I was going to do a warrior next. Nice. Just one turn. Okay. I'm excited. I haven't watched it yet, but my brother, damn, oh, hold on, let me take care of this first. Governor Reyna is in Achen, good. Dan wants a diplomatic delegation. Sheep smoke cheese, huh? Sure. Mm. Now we're now open to visitors. And Catherine, now we're now open to visitors. All right, and Magdeburg needs housing. We'll get there. We'll get there. Uh, I guess let me bring Granary up before or after for this the next thing here. Kind of change that build order a bit. <coughs> All right, so hopefully my trader does not get harassed. Submit that file. So my brother's seen the Molly playthrough. I haven't seen that yet. From the but, first stirrings of life beneath water. But supposedly, but supposedly, um, it reveals that they finally have built queues for uh, Civ Six. So I'm so excited. I don't. You know, I think I've, they've had those since Civ Four, if not Civ Three. And I don't know really how to play Civ without it because it means I have to have these lists over here where I'm constantly looking to see what the heck I wanted to build next. <coughs> I mean, it's slightly less of a problem when you're playing single player, unless there's like a big, hey, he built right there. There's a big gap between your turns, but, uh... all right, let's go on a bit. Let's go get some truffles. So I'm quite, quite excited that that's coming. From the first stirrings of life beneath water, to the great beasts of the Stone Age, to man taking his first upright steps, you have come far. Now begins your greatest quest. From this early cradle of civilization on towards the stars. Queen Sandu, the stars reveal wow. you lead Korea. That is not how I would have predicted that you pronounced that name. Alright. Looks like I'm in danger of a, uh, whatchamacallit, dark age in two different games. A major defeat for me. 
guess this is the only safe place to go. <coughs> Let's see. That'll help me. Maybe. Alright, let's go to the next turn. And... Not sure why I wanted to do it here, but yes, let's make a city. Boom. That's right, I am working towards an empire. Cologne. Cologne. Okay. Let's see what our choice is. Ooh, horses. That's why I went there. Maybe. I don't know. Um... I'm gonna hold off on the campus until I'm over here. Right, can it be built here? Yeah. So let's hold off on that. Do we have some growth? You know what? Uh... Let's go ahead and put that trader, why not? All right, let's see. Let's build a trader. Then... Warrior. Slinger. Campus. If have land by mountain. Looks like they're going to have pretty relatively quick growth here, so maybe I'll do a granary after that. And then... Oh, then barracks. Um, what's the military? Yeah. Military district barracks. And that'll help me have another place for which I from, from which I can shoot people, like the Chinese, who are probably not happy that I settled right next to them. But it's not D David, so maybe I'll just take over if I build up my military enough. Three turns to hanging gardens. Warrior. Warrior. Okay. We'll see. <coughs> Something favorable just happened. beginnings you have shown remarkable growth leave your bronze for iron and rule with horse and sword the sky above begins to reveal its secrets a collection of heaven that uplifts our hearts and guides us to foreign shores all Spain stands ready to answer your prayer All right, where am I in relation to these things here? This guy's far, far away. All right, keep exploring this way. Ooh, we found Lisbon. They were at our us. Say again. They were at our. Like where? Where are us? Where are we? Yeah. Oh, I see. There. All right, Washington encampment. See, we've got the cash. Where should we put it? <coughs> so much rainforest. I think that'll be good in the future at some point. All right. Well, we gotta get rid of rainforest somewhere. Let's do that one. Yo. All right, warrior. Well, let's see. Hold on. Daddy. Ready? Yes. Wait, can I get my own thing out? Like, say again. 
Your tablet? Yeah. Yeah, sure. Boom, boom. Gotcha. All right, now you guys can finally start your journey. Oh, no. Scout. Okay. Uh, explore over here. Uh oh, if they come get me in one turn, I'm in trouble. Oh wow, lots of stuff going on here. Whoops. Great cities of stone and seen early empires rise and fall. Soon you will stand under the towering pinnacles of castles alongside your gallant knights. That is where the story of your people will be written. Just as the young apprentice learns to carry a sword. We're all apprentices in a craft where no one... Okay. Alright, we've got a horseman. Send him here. Alright, Delhi should build a campus now. Oh, let's see. Not sure if I have any iron. In fact, I'm pretty sure I don't. Oh, no. So. Let's see here. Daddy, this time there's like a, a Japanese thing. <coughs> mm-hmm. Alright, I keep this. <coughs> Seems like a logical choice here. From humble beginnings, you have shown remarkable growth. Leave your bronze for iron, and rule with horse and sword. The sky above begins to reveal its secrets. A collection of heaven that uplifts our hearts and guides us to foreign shores. In your people lies your greatest strength and... Give me a minute. All right, let's see here. Let's go here. Let's go here. Oops, did not mean to do that. That's weird. Okay, let's get a promotion. 
Nice. Alright. Come this way. Oh, I guess. Alright. Uh, cancel that. Save the game. Submit that file. Right, this has been Eric playing Civ 6 multiplayer. I'll see you next time. Bye.